it's game time, it's go time, and I'm ready to go. If you want to mess with me, well, that's going to be your fault. It's heart. It's all heart. If you settle for where you at right now, you will never be anything in life. This is one of my last football games, and I just got to put it all out there. What time is it? What time is it? Two thousand six. Two thousand six. Curtis, you better hit him. Good. The Big Bird Barons are close to breaking Europe's record for the longest winning streak. But what makes them different than any other team? It's not just a team anymore, it's a family. So football's a family sport? This is not a championship team unless we are a family. And every single day we come together as a family. We're aggressive, we love each other, we help out each other. You have to be together, you have to want it as much as the other person next to you wants it. Football. It's definitely, it's, it's all about, it, te it tests your toughness. You never give up. It takes that mental toughness just to, just to give it all you have and leave it on the field. And you know, that, that just proves how much of a good player you are. Being a good player means you have to be at the top of your game off the field as well. I'm gonna go 100% to get the best grades that I can and 100% on the field to do as best as I can on the field. And go into the whistle blows, that's what I say. As a senior, Colt knows he's close to the final whistle. One of my teammates, Bryson Randall, he, said, he started talking about uh, how seniors was one of the last games and it, it, it got me, it got me real deep and I was like, wow, this is it's coming to an end real soon, so I need to go out with a bang. Winning the championship would be a big bang, but what Colton's talking about is on a different level. There's definitely some stress in it. You want to keep the legacy rolling, and we definitely want to leave our own legacy with uh, with Bitburg itself. And we know we need to keep this train rolling. We're going to keep pushing. Building a legacy isn't easy, but Colton Engelmeyer is already doing it. It it makes me feel better to help somebody be better in in their life. So that's what I want to do is help people. Hit somebody, let's go! Hit somebody, Curtis! 58, Colton Engelmeyer, man, I love that guy. All our seniors, we're the kings of the school, and we love each other. He takes care of me just as much as I take care of him. This is how the program works. It's a family team. There's that word again, family. Thanks to their coach, these brothers know exactly how to win on and off the field. I'm not worried about you being able to Coach Lowry really stresses that, you know, you're a student athlete first, so you make sure you get your grades straight, and then, you know, when Saturday comes, take care of everything on the field. Grades come first in all circumstances then comes your family and friends, and then comes football. That's just reality. So it's grades, family, and football for these three kings. And they're pumped up and ready to do battle. You always have to strive, and you always have to push forward. You, you keep going, and you keep pushing yourself harder and harder. The intensity level is always increasing. When you get on that line, you know that it needs to be time to go. You need to jump off that ball. You need to make something happen. You hit the same person almost every single time, and you want to make sure it's going to be either you or it's going to be him that's going to give up, and you got to make sure it's going to be him, and you just shove it right down his throat. There's no need to give up on a goal that you've set in life, and uh, just keep pushing for it. Just keep pushing for it, and you'll get it no matter what. You just, you just got to be ready for whatever happens, whatever comes. Ready for anything, on the field or off. And they know why we're Bitburg and why we win is because we're the meanest, we're the toughest, and we're ready for anything. From Mrs. Adelson's creative writing class. Are you ready with something? As I waited in the line, I could see it. As she slapped it on my plate, I wanted to rebuke it. And as I sat to eat it, I felt it trudge down my unknowing throat, the day of mystery meatloaf. To meatloaf. Together, these brothers are ready to face anything. From Bitburg Air Base, Germany, I'm Air Force Staff Sergeant Jason Bailey, AFN News.